Hello. I heard that you were new and that you were needing some guidance in our wonderful candy shop. Yeah? Perfect. Okay. So, there's no need to get up. I have just my little card over here, and I'm going to pull out all sorts of different candies. Um, most of them we're going to try. Some of them it's more just for the aesthetic appeal of them. All right. All right. Good. First on my list. Also, um, here. Whenever you want something, just let me know, and I will write it down with my wonderful waffle pen. It smells like maple syrup. You're going to know how I know that very soon. Yes. Whatever you want, anything at all, you just have to let me know. Right? It'll be right here in my lap. Let's see. Let's start off with a class. Serving size is only one piece, I guess. This bag comes with about 18. Three fruitastic flavors. Double bubble bubble gum. Apple watermelon and grape. Yes. Feeling very simple, but I think throughout the day it could help kind of clear your palate. Yes. Now, are you interested in the watermelon, grape, or apple? Right. Here's a grape. And I'm going to take. Oh, drop that. I'm going to take a water. Put it on the lower shelf. Yeah, it's a little hard at first, but. What is that super sweet feeling? What you really want when you have candy? Well, yeah, I'm sorry. Mm hmm. Yeah. I'm not going to keep it in for too long because we have a lot to get through. But it definitely got the palette ready for the rest of the day. Mm -hmm. Let's see. Something super sweet. Let's start off. One of my favorite parts of a new testing. Guess how many Orlos are in this container? Yes, I'm serious. See if you guessed right. You get a very special present. Absolutely free for my card. I'm being wrong. Then you get a roll. And you make it slightly easier for the person that is. Yes, I actually recently just had to refill this because someone finally guessed right. Okay, let's watch your guess. Nope, I will say you were rather close actually. Okay, we will pull out a roll of free. No, look at me. These come in 10 pound bags for about $10 each. Mm -hmm. It's absolutely a steal for them. There was a, there you go, there was a issue with the, um, what's the word, the suppliers, I guess, no, manufacturers, I think, with the original packaging, so they had all these, like, surplus rollos, so they gave it to us just loose for an amazing deal. Mm-hmm. Sounds really good. Now, if you were curious what you could have won, let me just grab it. You could have won this ginormous chocolate kiss the size of my head. Yep. This 
go for about $15 each. Yes. But not today. Next time you come in. Yes. There are different ways to win these. Definitely. There's usually some sort of contest going on. Mm. What next? Yeah. Come with these. These are actually a specialty around here. Around this time. They are fully in season. And they are pure maple sugar. Yes, they tap, 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 these little uh, spigots in the trees, just kind of like how your water spigot looks. They just tap them in there, and the water goes drip, 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 but it's not water, it's sap, but it is clear. And they boil it down, and they boil it down, and they boil it down, until eventually all that's left is the sugars and the sap. Mm -hmm. Now, there's a point where you stop if you want to make like maple syrup, pure maple syrup. Um, sorry, this is actually hard to open. I should have grabbed scissors. I'll have to go get that in a minute. Um, yes, they will stop when it's very thick, viscousy color to make maple syrup. But they will go all the way down to candy form. Yes, it is the purest, most natural sugar flavor you'll ever have in your life. Mm -hmm. There's nothing quite like it. How much? The bag that I just showed you goes for about $17. It is rather expensive, but it is such a pure flavor and it is so, it's a natural process. Totally organic, but it's more than that. It is naturally processed, like it's made in this, these big metal cat kettles over fires. Mm. We get all ours. I think these are from Ohio. Mm. Orchard of Maple Products. A tradition in Chardon, Ohio. Yeah. Home of the Gwinnett County Maple Festival. Yes. Mm. It's absolutely wonderful. We have plenty else to look at today. Mm. Would you be interested in trying some Nature Valley Crunchy Oats and Honey Vanilla? Yes. It's not necessarily what you think of when you get into the candy store, but the honey flavor is definitely very sweet. It's definitely very an interesting flavor. They come in boxes like this. If you're not feeling it today, that's absolutely fine. Yes. It shows how varying candy can be. From the sickling sweet artificial flavor we start in the gum to the more natural flavors of the maple syrup mm. to the rich chocolate of our rolls. That's what we could go with. Is some gum again, but these are gummy worms. Mm -hmm. Yes, I apparently did have scissors on my cart, they were just underneath the gummy worms. Mm -hmm. Now, these come in five fruity flavors. Five fruity flavors, they come in orange and lemon. Pineapple and cherry, and then apple and cherry, which means there's only three different types. So I'm very curious why they branded as five. Here, I will give you a cherry and pineapple. Mm -hmm. For myself, 
I'm gonna surprise myself. Ooh, I think I might have the apple cherry. Mmm. Yes. Quite a rich flavor for gummy. Mm-hmm. Sometimes I can make myself laugh with the nutrition facts. But, we are at a candy shop. There's no reason to worry about those. I'm just gonna say it. Serving size, and three worms. This is another type of gummy that we have. These are um, fruit flavored snacks. These have no artificial flavors. This actually seems to be a favorite among the people that I um, give an introduction to. Yeah. That makes me sad. A really good gummy. Yeah, these are technically all fruit snacks, but the same thing. Mm -hmm. You get a green one. I got two greens and a purple. Here, cast them. Yes, my purple looks like a snowflake, and the green ones look like blobs. I have no idea what that shape is. It's definitely the same shape, though. I have no idea. Mm -hmm. It's likely definitely isn't as pronounced, but you can definitely tell it's a bit more natural. Yeah, boxes are uh, on sale right now. They are two for four dollars. Yeah, so two boxes. Okay, boxes, fruit snacks. Perfect. Hmm. You know, we seem to be on the theme here, so let's just continue with the gummies. Yeah. This is something that actually is also locally made. Mm -hmm. These are Gustav's rainbow laces. Yes, you can only buy them here. Um, they are five ninety-five a pound, but these are one of the items that you can uh, decide how much you want. Mm -hmm. Quite delicious. Here, grab your flavor. Excellent choice. Yes, red is also one of my favorite flavors, but I don't, there isn't a bad flavor. Mm. Yes. Mm. We also have um, more like a, not really like a, uh, kind of like a fruit by the foot. We know what those are. Yeah. But just like thin strips. Mm -hmm. Great for lunch boxes. I like that. I think these are also really fun too. Mm -hmm. Half a pound then. I do Half pound laces. You can always ask the cashier to um, preference one flavor over another. Mm hmm. Mm 
Now, would you like to go to more of our confectionery, more of our sugary stuff, or would you like to start branching with the chocolate? More of our sugary? Okay. Let's see. <laughs> now, we do have like your Tootsie Pops, your Dum Dums, your more traditional sugar. Okay. But we also have these that are 39 cents each. And they are the Smarties. They are Smarties that are very big with two different flavors. And, um, yes, we also do sell Smarties if that is something that you, um, mm -hmm. yeah. I get it. Not the most flavorful of candy. Another thing we have which we sell these five dollars per pound are called safety pops and i'm not really sure if they're any safer for children i feel like they'll probably be easier to grab once they're in their mouth but here are lollipops on one side there's a letter on one side there's a number and instead of like the traditional flat stick they are in a Pattern. Yes. So this one you can see has a six. And then this side, a little bit hard to see, there's a J. Oh. Ah. You can have one. I'm gonna grab one. You definitely can see the J on that side. The six on that side. Our sample bag um, has a lot of orange in it. Not everybody's favorite, but there's a lot of uh, red and green and blue and uh, orange and yellow. That will be as a kind of trash register, and you can definitely tell them if you're more preference to one color. Mm -hmm. Now we do pack here. I get it. The sweet ones aren't always the most exciting. I don't like the chocolate. What I could do, I got one more non chocolate. These are quite a bit more interesting, I think. But let me finish this real quick. Mm These are called Botan Rice Candies, and they are a product of China, and each box comes with a sticker. Now I will open this up because it's very hard to explain. These candies, although the center is a sweet rice candy, they're actually surrounded by a paper, like an edible paper, and then there's also a... Uh, Uh, normal wrapper, like a plastic wrapper, mm. is quite enjoyable. Mm. Yes. This is what they look like. Here, you grab one too. Right, let's see what our sticker is. Always oh, very strange. Very strange. So, I can't tell if that's a, I think that's a kangaroo. Very strange. I always say it's a skirt to add to our collection at the register. Okay, yes. What you do is you just, you open it like you would a normal piece of candy. But as soon as you go to open it, there's like another inner layer.
see how it has that inner layer. Now that is absolutely entirely made of rice paper. It is and it's entirely edible. As you could saw, as you could have just seen, it completely dissolves on the tongue. Now I know some people who are a little weirded out by that, so they try to pull it off. It's not possible. pretty hard. You kind of just gotta chew it and then it'll become very soft. Mm -hmm. mm. You'd like to take some to your brother. Okay, how many boxes? They run about a dollar each. I think it's 99 cents. Mm-hmm. It's one of those candies. It's definitely a quiet taste, but once you get into it, it can actually be very be very delightful. It's not as cloying sweet as some of the American candies. But it also not as rich. It's like something like chocolate. It's a very hard flavor to describe. Hmm. That doesn't taste like rice either, does it? Corn syrup, sugar, water, and then rice flour, wafer pater, oh, I was wrong, and a sweet potato starch, there's the wafer paper. Uh, and candy shelves for rice candy. I was told that wrong. Hmm. Yeah, it's quite interesting, isn't it? Now, we also have a large, large, large assortment of the traditional dog candies. I don't want to do this today because we have already tried so many. And I'm sure we've had these in the past. Yes. What I can let you try is just a taste test. We have Kinder Eggs here, which are eggs that have toys inside them. The thing though is, is that we carry two different brands. We carry the Kinder ones from Germany and the Finders Keepers, which are from the US. Now the Finders Keepers aren't very um good. They're like cheap candy. This though is very high quality candy. So we're gonna let you just grab a piece of that. White chocolate in the I mean, milk chocolate on the outside. But yeah, they are so much better. Then let's see the candy here, but we prefer to take it apart just because um, our owner collects the toys, honestly. And um, it would be very expensive to do an egg for everyone. Mm -hmm. Let's see what's next. Ah, we have two things left. Last thing. I don't know why I was getting so many of these, but we have some chocolate frogs with milk chocolate frogs with crisp rice. Yes, quite delicious actually. I'm quite fun of the I don't really um, collect most of the cards. They're cool though. I'm gonna open up one and we'll split it. I think I just cut the card. Oh wait, no, I didn't. Oh, thank goodness. 
so they come with a card. And you can sort of see she lifts up her hand and she it's very hard for me to get her hand down. Um this is Madam Rolanda Hooch, flying professor at Hogwarts, also referee for inner house quidditch matches. Uh athletic looking with a short grey hair, piercing golden eyes, and hawk like profile. Used to be Chaser for the English Quidditch team. And inside, I'll give you half. I did it just enough. There you go. Mm -hmm. It's like, I feel like the Kinder Chocolate might be better. It's not a bad chocolate, though. No. Yes, that's right. Do you like any of those? They are on sale this week. Oh, that's why I have so many of them. They're on sale this week, a dollar a piece. Mm hmm. Okay. Wow, oh, someone's a Harry Potter fan. 15 chocolate box. Ah, oh, going for a whole set. Alrighty. Hmm. Our last thing. Another surprise. Oh. Some of the other things that I'm supposed to show are our Finders Keeper collection, which is fun to them. They run at two dollars for six. Again, uh, we, we can only do like one frog or one of these. And since I heard Katie's Skinner chocolate, I thought I would do kind of the cooler toy. Yeah, I think the uh, Harry Potter thing is just for the core. Also, uh, you can keep this card. Yes. Yeah, the card is all yours. Okay. Uh, the other things that I have to show you that we have for sale is what do you do? Like fun dip. Uh, pixie sticks, which you can see over there. Um, just pretty much any kind of candy, I can imagine. And also, we do more I guess higher quality chocolate like truffle and dormant and gotcha. Mm. Yeah. This is the 1922 masterpiece of dark chocolate ganache. the dark chocolate ganache inside definitely comes out the more that you enjoy it. Or no need to do that, Henry. Just enjoy it. So, anything else that you can think of, Dolly? Or I... Add up your total. Mm -hmm. Yes, I will add up your total and then hand it to the cashier. And she will be more than pleased to gather up any extra cash you might want like your um laces like that that she has to do okay a pound of pixie sticks okay um what's the price of this one on that looks like 250 back so that's 250 then anything else mm. all right yes it's Two for a dollar on the Lindor truffles. Uh, what flavors? Dark chocolate, perfect. All right. Well, I'm going to add up your total, and then I will get this to the cashier. Feel free if you want to go browse through the rest of our store. Um, I know that the baker would love to show you around. Also, he's got so many beautiful. Mm -hmm. Right, well, it was an absolute pleasure to meet you. I hope to meet you. I hope to see you again around here real soon.